some of the sounds that I love, some of the samples that I sought was created by a guitar. When you hear a song like Fourth Chamber, which is my synthesizer, but I'm actually trying to emulate what a rock guitarist would do on a lead, on a, as they call, sh uh, shred out, right? Yeah, shredding. Yeah. yeah. yeah shredding. Well, the title, we had a, a, a whole slew of different titles we thought about naming the project. But I think as we was looking at the graphics and looking at everything we was doing, we pitched the idea to each other, anything but words, because we felt that what the music does, it says it all. Using words to describe music is like using dance to describe architecture. Mm. I've ever heard that one. Paul, one thing about his writing, uh, he's very meticulous in his writing. I'm, I'm very meticulous in the sense of when it's time to mix and finish the album. When I'm creating, I'm painting all kinds of shit. <laughs> you know what I mean? But when it's time to like, okay, well actually, this is actually a, a picture of a landscape. And then I'll pull back and pull back so you can see what it is. So I'm like a fan of filmmakers like David Lynch and I like, you know, what I do lyrically is always kind of weird. And RZA's production creates a, a space and an atmosphere sonically that is like more mysterious and more kind of odd at times than other hip hop production. You're getting some of the Interpol energy and you're getting some of that Wu-Tang energy. There's always a piece of Wu in there every step, every every day, every walk. You know what I mean, Wu-Tang is forever, though. I'm sure yeah. Interpol is in Paul. So this hybrid of what we've given you guys, and we can call it a hybrid, or a good hybrid, like the Tesla. Yeah, more like the Tesla yeah. than the Prius. Kind yeah, of thing. yeah, that kind of hybrid, you know what I mean? Or that BMW that, with the, the BMW, BMW with hot. the both bong bongs. Bass and stills in the building, flash the camera. I'ma drop the hammer. Things done changed the hip hop since I let Bobby out the slammer.